Okay, guys, today I want to talk to you about something, I don't know, I don't think some people get it, but I want to talk about personality. There you go. Personality. That's what sells on YouTube. And what am I getting at? Well, I'm going to have to get on the bike, get the old brain going, and let you know what I'm talking about. See this sign here? This is Otter Creek Tavern. I don't know if you guys can see it well or not. The sun's shining off of it a bit. But this is the Otter Creek Tavern. This place has personality. And what do I mean by personality? Okay, there's a lot of people following the trend. Nobody's being unique anymore. I know it's hard to be. There's all kinds of stuff on YouTube. But here's the thing. If you're in it for a business, more power to you. But if you're in it to be an individual to put up some really cool and exciting videos that appeal to your average day man or woman, your average day person, you want to be yourself. Oh, you want to be yourself. That's tough. Because everybody wants to emulate someone else to, that is really, really famous. Hence the reason I did, buy, did not buy a Grom. There you go, guys. How about a Z125? Why? I didn't want to be like everyone else. So with the current trend, everybody seems to think that they need a drone. They need an R1. They need an R6. They need a Ducati. They need, they need, you know, the best of the best cameras. I'm going to tell you this much right now. Oh, my goodness. I'm shooting you this with a Drift Ghost. Yeah, I own GoPros. I'll admit it. But you know what? It's all about the personality. And these people keep trying to shove stuff down your throat. Content, content, content. Well, maybe more content. Or somebody's idea of quality content is way different than mine. I subscribe to people doing... <laughs> I subscribe to people for their personality, not just their content. Not that the fact that they have a fancy bike or use fancy cameras. I subscribe to people because of personality. Their content... You know, at least put me up a video once a week. And that's cool. But everybody that's telling you to get the best of the best, editing software. I edit most of my videos with freaking Windows Movie Maker. And then I use PowerDirector 13 or 14 or something like that sometimes. When I got to get a bit more precise, say on audio. You don't need those things. It's not a popularity freaking contest unless you're in it for the money. For me, I'd rather watch some Joe Schmuck build a fire in his backyard and have a good time. Not tell me all the cool gadgets and crap that he's got and how he uses them and all that other stuff. Here we go, sitting up 60 miles an hour. So there you have it guys I I don't get it I guess if you want to stay on the stylish trend be trendy and if you're in it for the money then maybe you put money into it but I'm gonna tell you right now there's not much there is some money to be had but not much it's, unless you're the Casey Neistat of the world or whoever PewDiePie whatever <sighs> yeah on that note, I'm going to stop right here. The Mini Z loves you. Got a new name, Karma. <laughs> the Sarge loves you. Sarge out.